Hey guys, I'm Big Mac Davis here, and we're back finally with more of the Doom 2 100% walkthrough for the PC. Played through Z Doom on the Ultra Violence difficulty. This is Map 6, The Crusher. Now let me just say this right now we are back on schedule with the uploads. I don't see any more lapses in the uploads ever since we got switched to Google. So, with that said, let's get to it, the Crusher. Alright, so when you fire a shot in this room, a number of shotgunners will come for you, so just wait on the left side for two more to come for you. There is also a revenant in this starting room over here, and you want to make sure he dies. Use the pillars as cover if you need to. And then you can go around and kill the remainder of the enemies that are behind the pillars. And once they're all dead, somewhere on the left side of this room there is a pillar that has a panel on it, right there. You can lower it for a secret, which is a megasphere. It gives you 200% health and 200% armor. Now find the lift and go down it, and look what we have over there. A spider mastermind. Let's flip the switch and then hide underneath the spider mastermind because that switch that we flipped will actually trigger a crusher to come down and crush her to death. And let's hide before we die. And if you want, you can also shoot the spider mastermind while she's being crushed to kind of speed up the process, if you will. This makes it go by faster, but also make sure to flip that switch, otherwise the Crusher will not start. And the Mastermind is dead. To stop the Crusher, just go underneath the Crusher and it will stop. And you can grab the Plasma Gun from here. Now in this slime trench right here, you can kill the demons, and there's a reason for this. Because at the end of the trench is a secret area with a teleporter which will take you back to the crusher. So yeah, now we'll lower the lift and ride the lift to the top. Now there is a break in the lift right there that you can run straight forward and onto the ledge below. Now flip the switch, see that platform with the blue key that lowered? Run to it quickly and then ride this lift up. Up here there are a number of imps, just take care of them. And you're rewarded with a soul sphere. Now from here you can actually kill the imps over there with the rocket launcher if you don't end up splatifying your face. And they're all dead, okay. So the easiest way to get back over there is to just relower this lift and go back up and run through the break in the lift fence. Alright, and now we're back on this ledge, so we can investigate all of these cages for some energy cells. And we're done with this room. Now if you're careful, you can strafe run over the trench. If you end up missing the trench, you can just go inside the trench and retake the teleporter to come back here. Anyway, ride this lift back up, and then go to the left side of this room. This will have opened up. You want to be careful, this is nasty. It has some chain gunners, shotgunners, and even some specters. Very dangerous room. So once they're all dead, just grab the items from their opening, and near this opening you'll find the blue door. So let's go through it. Now flip the switch, it will lower down this lift, but behind where the lift has lowered, there's an opening with some imps. You have to re-lower re the lift to get inside with some armor bonuses. Now let's re-lower this lift and ride it to the top. There are a number of enemies here. Just kill them all, as is very standard in a Doom game. And that's all of them. There's the red door. We'll come back later on when we have the red key. Now through this door, when you walk up the first flight of stairs, have the rocket launcher ready, 
Kill those gunners. They're very deadly. Now up this second flight of stairs. You want to inch your way up while killing these enemies on the left because have the plasma rifle ready because when you run up, yeah, we get three revenants. The plasma rifle is the best weapon against these guys. Especially from a distance. Now on their platform, on the revenant's platform, is a super shotgun. Don't fall into this poison down below. There's no way back up and you will die. Just continue up, grab the red key, this will lower down, kill the specters and the lost soul, and then your reward is an energy cell pack. Now there is a secret area at the very top of these stairs. See that ledge with the dead gunners? That is a secret area, but you can't just run onto this ledge just like that. You can't do that um, in Doom. What you have to do is actually use the second step. See the second step right there? You have to run off of that step onto the secret ledge. It's pretty precise, but that's the only way across. The reason why it's so difficult is because behind this wall, there's a Megasphere. Which is a very nice reward, especially for this map. And the barrels, yeah, you can just blow them up and kill your enemies. And now we're done with this area, so let's go back to the red door. But be careful, there's a trap along the way to the red door. But it's not that nasty. And here's the red door, let's go through it. Now this Hell Knight, I like to wait for him to come closer to me. Because I don't want to fight him out in the open area because there are gunners to the right, and I'll just be shot. And there's the gunners. Again, don't fall in the poison area. Well, it's actually lava. You'll never get back up. Chain gun works wonders for these gunners. Alright, so now we'll go through this door, which is a pretty nasty area in the, in the later portions of this level, or of this room. Now, down in this slime trench, there are a number of specters. It can be hard to see them, especially in this particular source port, Z-Doom. They really make the specters hard to see. But eventually, with enough work, you can kill all of them inside this trench. Also, don't take any of the teleporters just yet. You don't want to do that. What you want to do is press the switch to lower the yellow key, but when you grab the yellow key, shoot your plasma rifle through this new opening. There are a lot of enemies that will teleport in if you don't. Once you have dwindled their numbers down, you can use either the super shotgun or the chain gun to kill off the remainder of the enemies that have teleported. That's a nasty area. And then you can use any one of the teleporters, it doesn't matter which one, to come up here where these enemies were. And now we'll flip the switch. This switch will raise up a bridge to the yellow key, which will allow us to exit the level. And that's it. Oh my, what to say about the Crusher. It's a step up in difficulty. Every map that we're going to be playing from now on is always going to be a step up in difficulty. With some minor exceptions in some maps. Some maps are easier than, ever, than others, but for the most part, it's going to be much tougher. So, th this map is a precursor as to what the deadly traps you'll be seeing along the way will be. This map is tough. I mean, it's tough all the way through, and you have to be careful around every step. Because not only do you see enemies around corners now, traps will also open up, sometimes in the most unexpected places. And if you're not ready for these traps, you're going to feel the heat in this map. Thankfully, though, two of these secrets have megaspheres. So, there's no real reason why you shouldn't really beat this map because of the secrets with two megaspheres, so that's easy enough as it is. 
The spider mastermind in this map is easy peasy to take care of. You shouldn't have any troubles if you press the switch to lower the crusher on her. That's why this map is called the crusher, obviously. So yeah, a fun map, a challenging map, I like it. So with this done, we'll move on to Dead Simple, the seventh map of Doom 2. But first, there's a story. You have entered deeply into the infested starport, but something is wrong. The monsters have brought their own reality with them, and the starport's technology is being subverted by their presence. Ahead, you see an outpost of hell, a fortified zone. If you can get past it, you can penetrate into the haunted heart of the starbase and find the controlling switch which holds Earth's population hostage. Yes, we... Th Earth is in serious jeopardy right now. It has been overtaken by these demons. They have captured most of Earth's species and are holding them hostage. It's up to Doomguy to find the switch which holds them hostage and release them so they can escape. Let's find that switch. I'll see you guys next time in Dead Simple. I'm Big Mac Davis. Take care, everybody.